Hello guys, TKG's here for your comfortable Lost Like Life. In this video, I'd like to cover the recent updates and improvements that was live on KL regions. As the KL region update progressions are quite ahead than the global, so I thought it'd be great to share some plus infos for your Lost Like journey. Now follow me, I'll show you what you need. Echidna Raids was released about 4 weeks right now on KL region. So as they mentioned before, After Stories of the Echidna was added on this update. Echidna After Stories can start it from the new continent, Kurzan. And of course, just like the other After Stories of the region raid, to enter the Echidna After Story, you need to fully complete the whole gate of the Echidna. Also for the players who like the stories, new story cutscene from the Echidna Cruzan was added on the memorial room. 55 story cutscene of the Cruzan and the 10 Echidna cutscene was added on this update. So you can now replay the scene whenever you want. Memorial room can be found on the game menu. Clicking it, you can enter the memorial rooms and open the cutscene right away by interacting with the memory book. Additionally, for the frame limit function, new tooltip was added for the clear explanation. Actually, some of the guys can't understand about what these things is actually do and how they affect during the gameplay. So for that, or maybe for more clear explanation, new tooltip was added on this update for the background and the foreground frame limitation function. New stronghold size comparison function was added on this update. For more details for the stronghold installation, you can now preview the furniture size with character. So you can preview the estimated size of the furniture and the stronghold installation. Might be the good news for the Shadowhunter and the Machinist. During the raid, when the cutscene pops up, you have to waste your transform time, right? I mean, sometimes it will totally waste transform status, right? For that, small fixes was done on this update. Identity losses during the cutscene will be recovered to the level before you get into the cutscene when your transform turned off during the cutscene so you can fill up identity faster than the previous version. March 1st is an independence movement day and a holiday of the Korea, so the new hot time event is now opened today. Simply getting into the game will grant you some rewards and skin accessories like t-shirt, mask, flag hairband, sunglasses with the flag of Korea. In addition, playing 1 hour during the 3 days of the event will give you the additional materials, toys, car too. So if you are playing the game actually on KL region, try not to forget these additional rewards. Reward can be found on the icon which located left of the minimap. Also at the February 28th, letters from the new director was updated on the official notice. And it is revealing the upcoming updates and the direction for the current Lost Ark. First, they decided to aim down the difficulties of the Akita raid on the future. As the new end contents, Echidna and the Thermine has quite stressful mechanic and takes up too many times for actually clearing it. And that thing is now hardening the stress of the weekly homework of the Lost Ark. And of course, you need to prepare a lot of things. I mean, mostly they raise the transcendent system to the third level to play the Echidna right now. So for that, they decided to change the raid contents to more user friendly. So I think they are going to lower the difficulties of the certain pattern which leads to immediate deaths and the mechanic that are coming so fast without warning will be changed on the future. Also he mentioned about the new contents too. New upcoming raid will be the behemoth. And of course, as they mentioned, it will be the new styled raid contents than the previous version. And unlike the other raid or end contents, it has only one difficulty, normal. And the raid can be entered on 1640 characters with the 16 players, with the gigantic raid boss which was briefly seen on the new content Cruzan main story. Personally, I think, I don't know, it reminds the day when I was waiting for the players all the time. And um, there was no mention about the balance patches on the future. Well, actually they said they will do the balance patches often on the future. But there was no single mention about the balance patches in the director's letter. So I guess we have to wait for the new notice or the updates on the future. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching everyone. And always thanks for your big support. Hope this video was a little helped for your Lost Ark journey. Hope you do well with your Lost Ark with this video. 
And of course, if you liked my videos, hit the sub for more upcoming infos. I'll come back with more useful infos in the next video.